going on everybody? Welcome. So I hit the road and I went to a YouTuber's house to check out the systems that he has down in his basement. And this is definitely one of those situations where you see his stuff on uh, YouTube, he posts videos and you're like, wow, that looks good. But when you see it in person, it's definitely, definitely way better. I was thoroughly impressed and I wanted to share it with you guys. So this YouTuber happens to be Dave's Nanotanks. If you are not familiar with Dave or his channel, I'm going to be leaving the link to his channel in the description of this video. I highly suggest that you scroll down a little bit, go into my description right now, find that link, then go over to his channel, hit the subscribe button, and hit the bell because he does streams once in a while and they're always really fun. So definitely go check him out. Now we're not going to be talking about anything in particular with his system and what he has going on. But I'd like to talk about Dave and his channel because it's one of my favorites. Now, I'm a big DIY guy, and this guy has lots of DIY going on, especially this tank that we're looking at right now. He bought a bunch of glass, bought a bunch of silicone, slapped it all together, and it worked. And he's successful with his DIYs, which is kind of cool. I've gotten some ideas from him. I've gotten some tips from him. And, uh, you know, it's just always good to watch. He has... A lot of videos on how to's, coral care, fish care, you know, identification. He's really good at figuring out what kind of bugs or pests that you may have, what type of coral it is. He's like the encyclopedia that you most likely will ask him a question or two and he will have an answer for you. And if he doesn't, he'll just straight up tell you, I don't know, bud, you might have to ask somebody else. And that's cool. He's not gonna beat around the bush. He's just gonna tell you how it is. And that's exactly what this channel is all about. It is what it is for Dave. He's really great at just putting things together, making it work, making everything just, in my eyes, successful. He's come a long way and um, i just thoroughly impressed with his system. He has three actually. So he has the big 100 gallon. He has this 55 softy tank that he likes to call it. Now. He ended up just getting this tank just because he had a lot of coral to just throw in there. Some overgrown coral. He is good at growing coral. Trust me. You go back to his previous videos. He used to be all nano tanks. That's why he got that name. We made him keep the name, even though his tanks aren't so nano anymore. But that's it. He'll always be Dave's nano tanks, and for a reason because he has multiple tanks. Like here's another DIY. He took this Red Sea sump took out the baffles, cleaned it up, painted the backs inside, and turned it into a frag tank. He grows coral, he needs a place to put it, and the cool thing is, is that's kind of like his little vault. So whenever we do these meetups, or if anybody that he knows needs some coral, he always has quite a bit extra on hand. So if you ever meet up with him one day, he'll probably have like a Ziploc bag full of frags for you. So make sure you bring your cooler. But, you know, I just want to give my kudos to Dave for having such success, great channel, great reef tanks, and um, he's a great friend, very full of knowledge, and I highly, highly recommend, again, that you go check out his channel and hit the bell, hit the button, hit everything. Just start typing all kinds of stuff on the keyboards. So, I'm going to end this video here, um, and... Look at that little frag right there in the left there. That's I took that home. I took that one home. That one's mine. It's in my tank right now. Thanks, Dave. So I'll see you guys around. And Dave, I will definitely see you soon, buddy. I'll see you guys later.